This video should hopefully answer the question of who is really controlling the world. The quite laughable suggestion that the Rothschilds are running the world is lunacy. A few minutes of research shows who is really running the show, of course. The superior general of the Society of Jesus, the Jesuits. What is my evidence for these claims? The founder of the Rothschild dynasty, Mayor Amschel Rothschild, is the definition of a Hofjuden, a papal court Jew. It is a fact that Mayor Amschel Rothschild was a crown agent of the Holy Roman Empire, having been granted this position in 1800 by the Emperor. Rome was running the world before the Rothschild came along. What on earth would make you think they aren't running it now? Mayor Rothschild, this Sabbatian Frankist Hofjuden, this court Jew, had five sons, like father, like son. For these Rothschild sons were Hofjudens, Amschel Anselm Mayer, his first son, who remained in Germany, was a knight of Malta. Nathan Rothschild, who went to England, was a high Freemason. He was a member of the Freemasonic Emulation Lodge of Improvement, in London. His brother, Jacob Mayer Rothschild, was also a member of this Masonic Lodge in London. Jacob Mayer Rothschild was also a 33rd degree Scottish Rite Mason in Paris. As we should know by now, Freemasonry is Jesuit controlled at the highest levels. Unsurprisingly, Karl Mayer von Rothschild, who was sent to Naples, was also a papal knight. This Jesuit foot soldier was a knight of the sacred military Constantinian Order of St. George, an even more powerful knighthood than the sovereign military order of Malta. In 1822, all Rothschild brothers were made barons of the Holy Roman Empire by Francis II. Are we starting to get the picture here? The Rothschild family are bankers of the papacy. How laughable to suggest that they control the world. They are merely knights and barons of Rome, nothing more than guardians of the Vatican's and Jesuits' vast imperial wealth. The current head of the family, Jacob Rothschild, is a knight of the British Empire, who knighted this Hofjuden. Why? None other than Dame of Malta, Queen Elizabeth II the same Queen Elizabeth who is subordinate to the Pope and the Jesuit superior general. It should be becoming very clear to see that the Rothschild family cannot possibly run the world. It is quite frankly, utterly bizarre to claim otherwise. There is simply no supporting evidence. Isn't it funny how we hear so much about these half Judans, yet never hear about other families? such as the Orsini and Aldo Brandini families, yet they are far more powerful. The Queen is subordinate to the Lord Mayor of the City of London Corporation, the Square Mile. The City of London is till this day, controlled by the Jesuits of Rome, via the control of the Sovereign Order of Malta, who took control from the Knights Templars. As Dame of Malta, the Queen is subordinate to Rome, so are the Rothschilds, a banking dynasty started by a Hofjuden, crown agent of Rome, Mayor Rothschild in Frankfurt. These Sabbatan Frankists are powerful, but certainly not what they are made out to be. We need to stop looking at these Masonic Knights and start looking at the Jesuits of Rome. Rome has always, always, put Hofjuden traitor Jews in front while the Jesuits remain unseen. David D. Rothschild was on Alex Jones' show, nothing more really needs to be said. Do you think you would ever see the Grand Master of the Knights of Malta on the Alex Jones' show? Do you think you would ever see the powerful Archbishop of New York on that show? Keep in mind the Archbishop of New York is head of the American Knights of Malta. Do you think you would ever see the head of Georgetown University on Alex's show? Or perhaps the Grand Master of the Sacred Military Constantinian Order of St. George? Of course not, never in a thousand years would they be on his show. Yet we have David D. Rothschild on his show, how ridiculous and laughable.
It is hard to understand the insanity of the fascination with the Rothschild family. Seems like there are 150 videos on the Rothschilds for every one on the Jesuits. The absolute lunacy of the situation is striking. So much attention on Jesuit bankers. No attention on the real puppet masters, the Jesuits of Rome. Hopefully, this video has enlightened you on the real controllers behind the Rothschild family. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to this channel for more videos.